Well, hello, my berries. It's me, Darkberry32. Where do we go from? Where do we go from here? No one can save us, save us from keeping clean. So Kayla and Jordan are looking for places to move out to. The first place we go to, closed. <laughs> Get this, Dennis. Oh. We'll have to come back to this one one okay, day. We'll have to find another one. We'll find another one close. Why don't you just thing. go to that one? I don't care. I don't want to go there. Yeah. I love you more. I have one to list. Okay, yeah. all right, we're gonna follow this. We, we look at random ones later mm -hmm. on in the game. Now, let's see, we have this one. Hey, y'all, y'all like my new little hairstyle? Child. Y'all know Dark Baby be trying some things. Hello, everyone. I just got a big old puff in the back of my head. And, um,. Like I said, we're out with I'm out with Jordan and Kayla. They're looking for places to stay. Um, they're hoping to move out in the summer, and then Earl and I will have the house to ourselves. I don't even know how I feel about that. I'm I'm happy for them though. If they can do it, I'm happy for them. So yeah, y'all just stay tuned. Come on along. If we get to see some apartments, I'll show you. Okay. All right, so this is a two-bedroom model that Kayla's looking at. Pretty spacious. Nice and spacious, actually. But she's actually interested in a one-bedroom, but this is all they had to show her. <laughs> this is weird. It's like this bathroom, but the door is missing off of I guess they don't want people touching doors and shutting doors and stuff. Well, I like this bedroom. This is nice. So what you need to... That's how I would do if I had blinds like this. They probably wouldn't take them down because they're in every apartment. It's a cute little living room. So we have a little party. And then a little dining room area. But then I wonder... Okay, so what we need to look at... What we need to look at, look at the little wash and dry area. Everything little. Little, 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 little. This is cute. But see, this is a two bedroom, so I want to see what a one bedroom layout looks like on the map. This is cute. Well, the thing that you need to ask her is like all the amenities that are in here are these standard with all of, you know, like is all the carpet the same you know the hardwood floors is this the same in every apartment the molding um i seriously doubt that these mirrors are standard but you can ask her what it looks like standard with you know what kind of mirrors and stuff like that i mean did they have pictures online mm -hmm. okay we'll have to look at the pictures online because you know they're gonna make this look and then like the ceiling, I love the crown molding, but does that come standard? That's like gorgeous. And then like the, oh, it is dull in here, isn't it? No, I just don't like the way it looks. Um, it's kind of dull. But knowing you, you like stuff dark. Is that a good spacious pantry? Yeah, I'm I'm hungry. I don't have no food as it is. <laughs> it's, it's cute nice though. Room. It's nice. And then like the backsplash, like write these things down. Write this stuff down while you have time. Yeah, that's it. Well, put it in your phone or something, but just like take a pic just take a picture. You ain't gotta write it down, but take a picture of the backsplash of the floor. Of the crown molding so that way you're like okay hey is this the standard in all of your apartments do they all look like this do they all come like this that mirror and you know these mirrors in the bathrooms because don't show me no model and then i get into my apartment and you got 
Jack Rabbit crap. I just made that up, so hope y'all liked it. All right, this is one that we got to see, but it's nice. All right, y'all, so both kids, we're at another apartment complex. So I'm kind of sending them in without me because I don't want my children to be dependent on me on talking for them all the time and I didn't have an issue going with them today because you know like Kayla said mom you know the questions to ask and stuff like that and that's fine I do know the questions to ask but I am kinda staying back at a distance so that they'll know how to do this on their own how to speak and talk for themselves let me see I think they're coming is that them no it's somebody else coming out um, so I just kind of want them to see, you know, how to do this on their own. Now, Jordan and Kayla, they're probably not going to live in the same apartment complex, but this kind of gives Jordan insight on what to look for, what to ask and stuff like that. I don't think he's going to be as picky as Kayla. Kayla's very picky, like she's picky, particular about the outside, what it looks like, um, you know, like, like, I guess like the um, curb, curb appeal. You know, like when you see with the, when you drive up and you see the apartment, oh, yeah, this is nice, you know? <laughs> so, um, Jordan, on the other hand, is a is a boy, and he's just like, I need a place to lay my head. And I do know that he's a very, he kind of neat. He's a little bit more put together than Kayla is when it comes to, like, the things in his, inside, like in his room and stuff like that. But, um... Yeah, it's going to be interesting. I know Kayla is talking about moving out in a couple of months. Jordan might need a little bit more time. And I think he's talking about maybe uh, maybe four, maybe four months where Kayla is trying to do May. And what is it now? I might as well say it's April. So I think she's looking like late May, early June. Jordan's looking like late June, early July, something like that. So yeah, um, I'm proud of them. I'm so glad that they're doing this. Um, what's so crazy is that my kids have never lived in an apartment ever in their lives. Like even when um, their dad and I divorced, I was able to find a rental home for us to stay. Uh, me and their dad stayed in the apartment, but this is before we ever had kids. So, um, yeah, it's kind of bittersweet. I, I, I would love for him to know about this too. Like, guess what? Guess what kids are doing, you know? And he, and he can, like, they, they talk to him, but I, you know, it's like, oh, I would love for him to be involved or whatever, you know? Oh, wow. Somebody's moving in now. Like they got a car and a U-Haul. But yeah, um. I'm sure they'll tell him, you know, like, Dad, this is what we did today, and blah, 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 blah. It's going to be kind of cool. So, yeah, just trying to get them all settled. This is the part, too, where I've always thought about as a mom, like, did I set them up enough where they can do this? You know, where, you know, but they know how to make, they, they're, they're making a way along with, of course, God is is the, is the beginning of all of this, and He's all in this. And if it's time for them to go, it, you know, He will make a way. So, yeah, y'all. You guys, some of you guys have been with me for a long time. When these kids were like, Kayla was going to dance classes, 12 years old. And now she's 21 years old and looking for her own place. And... Jordan, you know, with, uh, with his animation and just... I don't know, it's kind of bittersweet, and then I am, I'm married now, and you know, y'all been with me through this whole thing, so it's, it's kind of nice when you start seeing a full circle moment, things are starting to, to change and stuff, so the seasons are changing, so yeah, but anyway, if we, if I get to go into this one, I'll, I'll film it as well, but I told them to go in there by themselves first, and if they want me to come, I will, but I'm trying to give them their distance, and plus mommy's hungry. They need to take me give me something to eat. All right. I'll just kind of. Okay, help yourself. All right. It is nice. Cute little. What do you think, George? I like it. Yeah. I like it a lot. Mm -hmm.
Oh, okay, but you'll see how mm -hmm. the modeling is. That's yeah. what we need to have our house. <laughs> okay, this, this is a nice big bathroom. It's a big old bathroom. It is. I like the openness too. Mm -hmm. Yes, it's nice too. and open. Mm -hmm. We've got brand new snacks. Are y'all hungry or need water? I'm hungry, but I'm, gonna hold it, I'm holding out for lunch. You're holding out? I'm okay. holding out. <laughs> we just loaded our refrigerator yesterday with a bunch of new Stuff. Okay. And no one ever will take it because I was at and maple cabinet. Oh, okay. well, this is cute. So it's not bad. I mean, it's cute as it can be. It is. Nice and bright. I like the carpet. Yeah, it, I mean, it's pretty carpet as far as carpet goes. Yeah. And how much is this? This one, one is uh, eight sixty. This is the B floor plan because you've got uh, the difference between the A and the B mm -hmm. is this area right here. You have room for a table. And this B. is B. So it's A60. Okay. A60 upstairs, A85 down. That's Because the price. downstairs is higher because you've got mm -hmm. that patio. That's two twenty-five. Um, this is such a cute place. Huh? Me too. It's cute. Hey y'all! It's Saturday morning, and I am thinking about doing some garage sale shopping. We will see. Um, one second. All right. Yeah. So as I was saying. Um, There's a friend coming. Let me go on and cross. Lord have mercy. There's a friend of the Lord, y'all. I think that's what that is coming. Well, no, maybe it isn't. I don't know what that is. Unless it's just the family. I didn't see anybody. Or it could be, um, you know, I always think about funerals as, you know, hers and a body and all that kind of stuff. And sometimes it could just be an urn. Um, so yeah, um, headed to this uh, community. Uh, it's a very nice community um, where they're having a garage sale. And I just kind of like to go out and see what I can find. Um, not necessarily looking for anything in particular, but you just never know when you go to garage sales. And um, yeah, and then I just need to do um, I need to go buy a gift for a birthday party. I'm not going to a birthday party, but I do need to buy a gift um, for my great niece. This is for my great niece. And um, yeah, she's turning two. So I want to get her something and make sure that, because um, I think uh, my brother is going to come by and grab it. Him and um, my sister-in-law will come by and grab it. And uh, yeah, want to do that for her. Um, trying to—I don't even know. <laughs> it's so crazy when they're that young. It's like, okay, what do you get them? And I don't want to. I don't. You know, a lot of people like to buy clothes and stuff like that. And that's fine. I don't want to do something but the actual child. You know, like toys and stuff like that I mean who doesn't want toys right when you're a kid so um so those are the things that are on my agenda today I wanted to clean out the garage today as well like get some things uh decluttered out of there um especially because the kids are thinking about moving and then they want to you know I just told them like you don't want to move junk you know what I mean so like go through your closets and then that way they can kind of put things you know in totes and stuff like that or in bins i got talked about when i called it a bin or called it a tote my kids like is it, what are you talking about a tote but anyway one of those bins uh oh it looks like my battery not, not my battery but my chip is going to go down in minutes so let me um
get some things off of there so you guys won't miss this vlog but while I do have your attention and I'm driving um, go ahead and hit the subscribe button if you're not already subscribed and um, yeah hit subscribe um, hit that bell notification so that you're notified every time I put up a video, honey. And don't forget to follow me on social media, guys. I am Darkberry32 on all social media, Twitter, um, on uh, Instagram, for sure. For sure is where you really need, Instagram is where you really need to follow me because I do tons of pictures and, you know, throughout my weekend and stuff like that. But uh, on Facebook, I'm Darkberry032. I don't get a lot of traffic over there. I don't get a lot of talking over there. So you guys hit me up over there and just, you know, if you are on Facebook, just, you know, say hi to a girl. I appreciate it, okay? Bye. All right, y'all. This is kind of a weird garage sale. <laughs> um, okay, so I pulled up, like this is sort of a gated community, right? So, I pulled in, they gave you a map of the garage sales, like where they are and stuff like that, which is great. However, everybody knows with garage sales, you put signs out. I don't know your neighborhood, and I sure don't follow maps. So, it's kind of weird a little bit because you just kind of got to drive around you kind of just drive around and then just see what you can find so I don't found a couple I guess right here but I don't know they they're not appealing to me because most of them are like clothes and y'all know a sister don't need clothes I like you know little items like for the house and stuff like that. That's that's what I'm kind of looking for. That's kind of what I'm looking for. Um, if I'm gonna tell the truth, I just I don't know. I'm just kind of. <laughs> that's what I do. Is like I kind of drive by. If I see something that catches my eye, then I will stop. Um. Yeah, I don't really, <laughs> I don't know. I like, I don't know, like little tchotchkes and stuff like that. Um, I think I just saw something that I would like to look at just now. Um, yo. Yeah, so y'all just bear with me. If I see something, I probably won't take the camera up to these people's homes because I don't want to do that. But I don't know. It's just kind of it's kind of weird. Like I'm looking for this one house. I guess I should have been looking at the name of the street to see if I'll even find it. Okay, I see back up in here that there's some stuff, but it's a lot of clothes. I don't need clothes. I really don't need clothes. But, and I understand they don't want to, I guess, litter their neighborhood with garage sale signs and stuff like that, but I don't know. Let me look at this, um, this one garage sale and then I'll see if, um, you know, just like what's the price on this one thing. It'd be nice to have something, this one little item that I saw. Alright, so I found like this little desk globe um, for Earl's desk. Might be something he would like. It was only like eight bucks, so we will see how that goes. Oh, yeah, they got a lot of tchotchke stuff over here, so this looks like a good place to stop, maybe. I'm going to pull up here. I want to block. I might just, just, I'm going to probably just park right here, and then I might walk a couple of other places and just see how things go. Alright, 
Wish me luck. And of course, I'll do a haul and show you guys what I get. All right. All right, y'all. So, I'm trying to fix my poof. <laughs> All right. So, I'm kind of done with the whole garage sale shopping thing. I totally forgot that I was supposed to go out with Jordan again today. I'm looking for apartments. And um, so, I'm kind of currently sitting in the car. Um, again keeping my distance and letting them do their thing so he's in there talking to um, the lady now and um, yeah so I'm just kind of like here for moral support for both of them and then um, we'll see what we can see I will try to also record what we see and you know so you guys can kind of just be a part of it because I think it's always interesting. I, You know what? That's kind of surprising me. You know, like me and Earl, we love to go look at um, model homes like you guys saw last weekend. We love looking at stuff like that. However, I didn't realize that apartment complexes had model units. Because I'm thinking, why would you... I mean, I understand that you're trying to pull people in, but why would you waste that apartment? You know what I mean? So... We will see how it goes. But yeah, I was like, why would you waste that apartment? Like, the one we went to yesterday that you guys saw, they had two model apartments. And I'm like, can y'all rent that space out? You know, I don't know. That's just me. But, um, yeah, so we'll see. Um, oh, yeah, and we, yeah, well, well, all three, all three that we saw yesterday, they were all models. So, I don't know, it was just kind of crazy to me. I was like, why? Why would you do that, you know? But I guess it's, it's working. Anyway, guys, um, if I get to go into these, in this uh, particular apartment, which is kind of nice, nice looking complex, um, then I will, uh, all right Bye. all right i want to just show you guys what i got uh from the garage sale um it was only well actually i only paid nine dollars for it i guess um i talked her down and um it's one of these roaster ovens that i've always wanted and uh, i can't wait to use it i'm still um got the stuff in my car so i just wanted to show you guys and then i just got this thing here for ginger to put in the ground um from the same lady and then Here's that globe I was telling you guys about <clears throat> for Earl's desk, but I'm going to touch it up and um, like spray paint around here, kind of touch it up a little bit. So yeah, that is it. I didn't get too much because I had to go and um, do, um, I had to, you know, leave and go be with Jordan with the whole apartment shopping. So I just wanted to show you guys. That's it. Of course, you have a coffee station and then on this side corner is so you'll have that available as well and you can also rent this out for $75 if you want to throw like a family gathering, a birthday party or anything. Oh, nice. So lots of space. They just upgraded this furniture too, so it's really nice. This is nice, <laughs> yeah. And on this side, this is where we have the gym and the vision center. So down here, we have computers set up and this is available during your office hours only. Mm -hmm. So if you need to print and pack something, we can do that for you. Oh. And down here, this is our gym, and this is also 24-hour access. Uh, so we'll have you know proper cleaning materials for after use and hand sanitizer, and then you have the bathrooms nearby. Okay. Hello. And we'll head back this way. from 10 a.m. to 10 p.m. Okay. Oh, this is nice. <laughs> you know what it reminds you of? Like, Caesars. Yeah, in, like in Caesar's Vegas. Palace. Yeah. Yes. Oh, my god. <laughs> That's so funny. I just actually just got back from Vegas. Oh, I did, yeah. too. You did? Yeah, we, oh, went, wow. we went Um, about three weeks ago. Oh, nice. Yeah, we were there three weeks ago. Nice. Yeah. It's so nice. Yeah. So, right. this is one of our Lux units. Oh, okay. Um, but space-wise and everything, it's going to be the exact same. Mm -hmm. The only difference with this one is the color scheme and the faucets. 
Okay. So most of them, the classic style and the price range that I wrote down for you, they have like the carpet. It's more of like the yes. beige tones. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, so you have these available, but the cabinets and everything, same setup, same appliances that come with the apartment. Mm -hmm. This is nice. Did the microwaves come too? Or? Yes, ma'am. Oh, that's nice. Hmm, this is good enough space. You don't need a little. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and then, of course, we have the ceiling guy in the living room, which is a must. Mm -hmm, definitely. <laughs> and then you have the bathroom and the bedroom separate. So, okay. if you have visitors coming over, you yeah. don't go into your bedroom or anything. That's true. This is nice size. Mm hmm. So you have everything you need and also includes the washer and dryer in there. Well. Oh, wow. That's awesome. Okay. And on this side, this will be your bedroom. Uh, so you'll have carpet in this specific unit. Mm -hmm. We only have one of these on the property. Oh, okay. So this is one of the rare ones that we have. Mm -hmm. And then you have a nice walk-in closet. In there. Yeah. So lots of space. For lots this of person. space. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, right. This is great. <laughs> and that's nice that you can go right out here. You know? Mm -hmm. You have your own patio and you have extra storage outside too. Oh. So you'll have this available. Mm -hmm. The only difference, honestly, is just the colors. Yeah. yeah. And then extra storage. So when do you have? When will you have a unit available, or do you have them available now? Uh, these in the classic, I don't have any of those. No, just like in the standard. Um, um, the standard. Do you have? All right. <laughs> <laughs> so we just saw another one. We sat in the parking lot and we looked <laughs> and we said. Hell to the now, to the now, now, now. <laughs> we are on our way to grab some lunch now, honey. We ain't even playing. Like, it's certain. I mean, I understand, like, some people have a budget or whatever, but no. That's not what we're going to do. We I'm sorry, but when you see a cat automatically just run across the street, it's like, okay. Not just that. Why the heck? All these different apartments had this caution tape. What am I? What am I being cautious about? I mean, it was like at least what six or seven different yeah. spots. And I'm thinking more than that, probably. I'm thinking did somebody get murdered and shot? Yeah, out here? like oh no, down. that's not what we're doing. We're not doing this today. So Jordan and I are gonna go to Italiano's. I want pizza like really crazy. I normally don't want pizza, but today um. You gonna make an exception? I'm making an exception because I'm hungry. So. Trying to get my puff together, child. I'm out here still looking like I'm garage still shopping. So we're gonna take y'all with this. Come on. Come on. All right, y'all. We for, totally forgot. We were so deep in conversation. This is what's left over of our pizza. <laughs> I had the sausage side. Jordan had the pepperoni side. So this is what we have left. And we're actually getting ready to go. I had a beer. And then, um, yeah, we were so deep in conversation talking about everything else that we didn't even record. I was like, oh my God. But this is Italiano's. It's a really good um, pizza Italian place. But you can get pasta and everything here. So we love it here. It's very inexpensive. Did you have a good lunch? Yes. <laughs> All right. So we're at the Target. I'm going to go try to find a gift for my great niece and see what we can find.
Let's see it. Oh, I think she ready for the mic, baby. Yeah. Well, hello, y'all. It is Sunday. Sunday fun day. I don't know if I want to say fun Sunday fun day for me. Because right now I'm in the middle of like cleaning like a crazy person. I guess sort of like a semi. No, this is like a spring cleaning just inside. We have not gotten outside. That'll be for another day, but I know we're going to have to go out in the garage and get things done because after a while, Kayla will be getting out of school. You know, like, months just go by so fast. I know, like, I mean, next week is April, and I think May, May or early June is when she gets out. So we need to get the garage together so that way when she brings her stuff home, you know, she has a place to put it, we hope, or... Well, maybe we don't hope because, you know, like I said, she's looking for a place to stay. So we're hoping that we'll just be cleaning and it stays clean because we don't need her stuff in there. But anyway, I am just kind of, yeah, I'll just show you. Right. I'm just kind of dusting and stuff. Just got things off. Y'all know how I do. I get things all nice and, and clean and everything. So that's what I'm doing right now. Cleaning. I got to, there's a stain here on my white rug compliments of ginger the dog if you know what I mean so I'm gonna go ahead and like shampoo well that part is shampoo so I just put a towel there because it was drying and I wonder about to put their wet feet on it but I think I'm gonna go ahead and shampoo the whole outer edge because it just looks kind of nasty um, yeah so just just a few things here and there I'm probably not gonna record it because it's not that interesting but um, then I'll probably, um, like this stuff here is starting to get on my nerves a little bit. Like all of this stuff up here. So I, I just kind of want a nicer, cleaner look or whatever. So um, just kind of get some of that stuff taken care of and get it done. And um, yeah, like even up here. And you know what I think is rubbing off on us? <laughs> it's the whole, we, we're looking at model homes and Earl's like, we can't live in a model home. I'm like, yeah, we can't. But you know, I can kind of you know get some things still looking better so yeah I might even get in here in the kitchen and, repl and remove some of these things but anyway that's just what I'm doing I will talk to you guys soon video coming up for you guys about uh, the house I actually um, did another friend budget friendly type of a makeover to the house so um, stay tuned for that you'll see that on Friday and yeah um, I think I'm gonna go ahead and sign off for the day because I need to eat dinner and I need to get this video up and running for you guys all right so Okay, I hope you guys enjoyed the weekend with us. We enjoyed bringing it to you. Um, so yeah, I don't know what else to say. Thank you again for watching, subscribing, and thumbs upping, and all that kind of good stuff. All right, talk to you guys later. Bye bye. All right, guys, thank you again so much for watching my video. But if you would like to stay in contact with me when I'm not on YouTube, you can 
do so by following me on Facebook at Darkberry032 and Darkberry32 on Twitter and Instagram. I'm always on Instagram um, putting up different videos. And again, if you don't mind, please hit that subscribe button. That would help me out a lot with YouTube and it'll get my algorithms up to par and everything. So if you guys appreciate these types of videos, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to hit the notification bell so that you're notified every time I put up a video. Okay, guys. Thank you again. Bye.